Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Civil Engineering Classes. In our previous tutorial, we learn how to draft the steel detail of a rectangular column having diamond shaped stirrup. Today we will learn to draft the steel detail of a rectangular column having trapezoidal shaped stirrup. So let's start with this tutorial. Now here the details has been given. The column size is 400 by 600 mm. Main bars will be 4 numbers of 25 mm dia. Secondary bars will be 4 numbers of 16 mm dia. Stirrups 8 mm at 200 center to center and clear cover is 40 mm. We'll take rectangle command and draw the column. We'll take dimension. Dimension will give 600 by 400. Enter. Now this is our column. First we'll give offset. We'll give clear cover of 40 mm. So we'll give offset of 40 here. Yeah. So enter. Now main bars are 4 numbers of 25 mm dia. So we'll take circle command to draw the reinforcement bars. We'll take tangent radius. Take this tangent, this tangent and give radius 25. Say so enter. Now this bars will come at all the four corners. So we'll mirror this. These are our main bars. Again we'll mirror this to the bottom. Say so enter. We'll hatch this with solid. And say enter. Now next we'll provide the secondary bars. The secondary bars are 4 numbers of 16 mm dia. So here we'll provide 4 numbers of 16 mm dia, 2 at the top, 2 at the bottom. So for that we'll have to divide this line. First we'll explode this. Now we'll divide this line give divide command and select this line now segments we want 3 enter now let's copy this circles take this quadrant point and select this here and here we'll remove this hedge because these are secondary bars delete this marks now mirror this. Mirror this both the bars. Now take fillet command. Take radius of 25 and take multiple and fillet these lines, all these corners. Say enter. Now this is one of our rectangular ring. Now we have to provide the trapezoidal ring. So for that take line command. Now press shift and right click and take tangent. Now select this tangent. Again shift right click tangent and select tangent of this circle say enter now we'll take a line here from this quadrant point to this quadrant point again from this quadrant point to this quadrant point and we'll mirror this line take the midpoint of this line as a baseline and say enter now next we'll provide the hooks for this both the stirrups. So for that take line command. Again press shift right click take tangent. Take this tangent point and draw a line here. Now take mirror command. Select this. Enter. 
product of the ortho mode in say enter again we'll provide stirrup for this sorry hooks for this take line command we'll take tangent now press shift right click take tangent select this point and draw a line and mirror this say enter now we got both the stirrups now we'll show separately this shape of the stirrups so for that take copy command select this column and copy it outside now we'll delete this first we'll show the rectangular stirrup extend this lines to this line now we are delete this Now here we will join these lines Take fillet command and fillet this Join this curve extend these lines now here we got the both the shape of the stirrups now let's name this take copy command select this bar and copy it here again take this bar and copy this outside Now take M text, multi line text. Now take multi line text. You will type mean bars are 4 numbers of 25 mm dia text height will change to 40 We'll copy this down. Now this is four numbers of 16 mm dia. The secondary bars and the stirrups are 8 mm at 200 center to center. So we'll copy this. We'll copy this here stirrups are 8 mm at center to 200 center to center we'll move this
so we are done with the trapezoidal shapes data so hope you all have understood how to draw this if you like this video please like and subscribe our channel to learn more about the autocad thanks for watching have a nice day